Prior to the actual sandblasting process, you need to check with your local government agency regarding restrictions concerning environmental and worker safety concerns. Here at Creative Blast Company, we use heavy-duty manufacturing equipment to produce our sandblasted signs. We use a 185 CFM Sullivan air compressor, and we use a 300-pound pot sandblasting pot. Here at Creative Blast Company, we typically sandblast our signs at 90 pounds per square inch of pressure. That's what's recommended from Harco using the 425S stencil that we use. The grit that we use is a silica sand based sand. It's a 440 fine grit sand. And what that will allow you to do is it brings the grain out of the background and it won't knock the grain down because it's too thick or too bold of a medium. We maintain a distance of at least 18 inches from the board face and you must blast at a perpendicular angle to the grain. And when you blast the sign, you must follow the grain pattern from left to right or right to left. We typically blast a quarter inch to 3 sixteenths deep into the wood. That seems to give you a good depth to create the 3D effect that you need for a good sandblasted sign. 